the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Jesus, in the Eucharist, you have taught us that real dialogue involves charity, courage, and humility in sharing the truth of our Christian faith. Cut away the tendrils of our religious biases and insensitivity, cultural discrimination, and other uncharitable thoughts and actions, so that we may yield a bountiful harvest for your kingdom. Amen. Jesus, perfect sacrifice, have mercy on us. Jesus, true sacrifice, have mercy on us. Jesus, new covenant, have mercy on us. Jesus, soul mediator before the Father, have mercy on us. Jesus, good shepherd, have mercy on us. Jesus, true light, have mercy on us. Jesus, bread of heaven, have mercy on us. Jesus, bread of angels, have mercy on us. Mary, mother of the Eucharistic Jesus, pray for us. A reading from the Gospel according to John. Jesus said, This is my commandment. Love one another as I love you. No one has greater love than this, to lay down one's life for one's friends. You are my friends if you do what I command you. I no longer call you slaves, because a slave does not know what his master is doing. I have called you friends, because I have told you everything I have heard from my Father. It was not you who chose me, but I who chose you and appointed you to go and bear fruit that will remain, so that whatever you ask the Father in my name, he may give you. This I command you, love one another the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to your Lord Jesus Christ. Mga kasambuhay, narito po tayo ngayon sa ating ikalimang simbahan sa ating Visita Iglesia dito sa Conversion of St. Augustine Parish at Shrine of Nuestra Señora de la Caridad, ang tinaguriang ina at reyna ng Ilocania dito sa Bantay, Ilocosur. Sa panahon ngayon, marami ang hindi pagkakaunawaan bunsod ng pagigiit ng sariling katotohanan. Sa pamilya o pagkakaibigan man yan, o sa pakikipagdayalogo ng simbahan sa iba't ibang relihiyon, kultura o tradisyon. Kung maalala ninyo ang nabuong pagkakaibigan ni San Francisco ng Assisi at ng Sultan na si Al-Malik Kamil, walong daan ng taon ang nakalilipas. Posible pala ang malalim na ugnayan kung bukas ang parehong panig sa culture of encounter. Tinuturuan tayo ng Panginoong Jesus na ang pinakahangari na pakikipagdayalogo ay pagkakaibigan, mula sa katotohanan at katarungan na hatid ng mabuting balita ni Jesus. Hindi ba ganyan ang tunay na kaibigan? Marunong makinig, iginagalang ang pagkakaiba-iba at tinatanggap ang kapwa. Nabanggit ng yumaong John Paul II na ang simbahan ay hindi nagpapataw, kundi nagmumungkahi. Ang simbahan ay nagbibigay panukala at hindi iginigiit o ipinipilit ang nais. 
Sa pakikipagdayalogo, hindi natin isinusuko ang ating pagkakakilanlan bilang Kristiyano. Ang pagiging bukas ay pananatiling matatag sa ating pinakamalalim na paniniwala na nagiging daan upang maging bukas tayo sa pag-unawa sa kapwa. Manalangin tayo. Panginoong Hesus sa Eukaristiya, hindi madali ang makadyos na pagmamahal at pakikinig sa kapwa. Ipagkalob mo sa amin ang iyong Espiritu, ang Espiritu ng pag-ibig na iyong lakas sa pagpapatawad sa mga umuusig sa iyo, ang Espiritu ng pag-ibig na naging inspirasyon ng iyong mahal na ina sa pagninilay sa misteryo ng Diyos, at sa pagyakap hindi lamang kay Juan, kundi kay Pedro na nagtaksil sa iyong anak. Kami naway mapuspos ng iyong pag-ibig, sa aming pagpapalaganap ng culture of encounter sa aming pang-araw-araw na buhay. Amen. Blessed be God, blessed be His holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be His most sacred heart, blessed be His most precious blood, blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar, blessed be the Holy Spirit, the paraclete, blessed be the great Mother of God, Mary most holy, Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.